Medicine in Ancient Greece. The ancient Greeks made lots of contributions to modern medicine. In fact, a doctor's vocabulary contains thousands of words with Greek roots, including paralysis, diarrhea, pancreas, and esophagus. One of the most influential doctors in classical Greece was called Hippocrates. At that time, most Greeks believed that diseases were caused by angry gods or demons. <laughs> Hippocrates, on the other hand, believed that diseases had natural causes which could be explained by science. Doctors who studied Hippocrates' methods looked after their patients well. Somebody call a doctor! They didn't use harsh or unnecessary treatments. The doctor is in. Some doctors still swear the Hippocratic Oath when they graduate from medical school. In it, they promise to help people and not to harm them. If Hippocrates was the father of medicine, then Herophilus was the father of anatomy. Although human dissection was forbidden by the Greeks, or at least very much frowned upon, he became an expert in human anatomy, how bodies work, by cutting open the bodies of as many as 600 dead prisoners. Oh no! He wrote books to explain things like circulation, digestion, the eye, the brain, pregnancy and childbirth. <laughs> he even gave the small intestine its name, the duodenum, 